Hi, this is Ushio. Welcome back to Monster Crown. So, yeah, we did a, a bit of a longer video on it last time, a bit of a longer gameplay. And it was mostly just an introduction to the game. Kind of, what is this game about? How does it work? What's good? So we've kind of got an idea of what it's like. It's a bit of a, a Pokemon-inspired kind of monster fighting action game. And it seems kind of interesting. But this is this is a bad matchup, but we're gonna stick with it. So we got our Rodask and we're fighting this sacred. But yeah, we hit a wall, we hit a boss, and we didn't know how to attack this thing. So I think we need to give it another go. I've kind of walked around a little bit and leveled up a little bit. And we've caught caught a couple of new monsters. I mean hang on, how'd you get to here? There we go. It's been a little while. Here we go. We got a Hooklaw, level 9, Primigon, level 7, a Harvest Skin, 8, Rodask is almost dead, level 6, a Zombie type, Laz, level 4, and then we got some, I don't know what this thing is, level 4, and a Sacred, also level 4. So, that's our current party, and I think if we go faster, you can kind of jump the fences. Okay, hop, and this is the thing we need to fight, so before we get involved with that, let's look at where are we? Tutorial. Battle. No, not, this is what we need. So, instead of having, like, in Pokemon you get your fire versus water versus leaf versus earth, rock types, you know, this kind of stuff. This is how it works on Monster Crown. You've got Malicious, Brute, Will, Relentless, and Unstable. I'm going to have to learn some of this stuff. I, I'm just going to take a photo of the screen with my phone at the minute. Because I think... If we know the type advantages, we should be a little bit better with this boss fight. It's the Waderus. Okay, let's have a look. So what is this thing? Enemy Waderus approaches River Boss. I don't know what type he is. Oh, he's... Okay, the photo I just took on my phone. I'm going to have a quick look, and I'm going to try and work out what that is. So is it is that like a, a fist? Is that what our illustration's off? It's a brute. Brute's immense strength powers through the malicious type schemes. Okay. And that is weak by... A, is it a malicious type? Is it this type? Uh, let's try... Rodask is almost dead. So we'll use that. Even though the attack type is a relentless type. Oh well, land, land a hit. Land a hit. Okay, Rodask is down. Which we knew that would happen. So, I think I want to go with a Laz. Laz, what is, type is that? Is that an unstable type? But he can do this thing where he can kind of infect the enemy. So as this is going to be a long fight, I think if I can do that and not get killed in one hit... Never mind. <laughs> okay, Primigon. Let's, let's take this a bit more seriously now. So, I think, if I look at his attacks, what have we got? A body tackle, a swipe, and a skull slam. I'm not sure what's best. Shall we go with skull slam? I don't think that's good, but we'll do it anyway. I mean, it hurt a bit. This isn't good. This isn't good at all. Okay, how about a body tackle? I mean, we are doing damage, but he is wiping us out really bad. One more hit is all I've got. Skull Slam. Okay. Sure. This is not working out. This is not how I wanted this video to start. But sure. No problem. I've got these guys who I think are going to die very quickly. Um, Harvest Skin. Good luck. <laughs> so, what attacks have we got? I've got Piercing Gaze. Which doesn't do any attack. And then we've got a Swipe. This is not, this is not working out. Let's do this. Let's drop his attack one time and he's giving me a slap he's only level nine we should be doing a little bit better than this but we are not we are taking all kinds of ridiculous damage uh oh uh let's go for hooklaw come on he he's our main one this is our main monster it's level nine versus level nine right so let's just go with it oh almost down one more hit should do it one more hit should do it finally Oh man, 4 XP, all of that for 4 XP. 
Okay, Laz is level 5. That was cool. Thanks, kid. You're a real peach. I doubt the boss is going to care for much for this thing. It only contains a map and some unintelligible scribbles about monsters. Nothing but garbage. But it's your garbage now, bub. Now, I've got a split. Okay, we got a notebook. Now, that's kind of cool. But I think, as we are well and truly hurting and busted, we need to run back home, heal up, and then maybe get back to the bridge. So, we did survive the fight. I don't know what that notebook was. Okay, Will beats Brute, Brute beats Relicious, Relicious beats Unstable, Unstable beats Relentless, Relentless beats Will. It'd be nice if I had that before. Okay, so let's, can we look at some of that other stuff? Okay, loading up. Oh, it's like a, oh, Pokedex, essentially, isn't it? So let's look at Tedon. This is our father's monster. Tedon attacks with the large jaws snapping shut on foes. Any attempts to shake Tedon off will fail. Their jaws lock and their large nostrils allow them to breathe without ever having to let go. When in groups, they may often frenzy. Let's keep away from these things. Okay, so we've got like a, like a Pokedex type of thing. So we need to go to the kingdom, the humanism kingdom, and deliver a thing. That is our next job. What is this? This is the world map. We are at the farm. So there's all these areas. The game is in early access, so I'm not sure if all of this stuff is accessible yet. And I'm not sure if I'm going to explore the whole game, especially if it's not finished. Maybe I can pop in every now and then if people enjoy this gameplay. I am going the wrong way. I gotta hop this gate here. Okay, this is new. Let's slow down a bit and let's explore nice and slow. Who's gonna greet us? Who's gonna attack us? And if we see something that we've never seen before, maybe we can recruit it. What is this, a raft? Can we ride that? I guess not. What is, what's down here? Hello? It's the harmless monster, Apo. Stay safe, Apo. Okay. Oh, what's this thing? Found a normal pact. And a pact is what you need to kind of... That's it. Yeah, if you want to recruit a monster, pact's what you need. That's it. Eat that thing. That's cool. Okay, so let's, let's jog on back up. What is up here? I don't know where to go. Hmm, let's go... No, this is, this is where we come from. Go this way. Follow the path. Just just don't stray too much. He says, walking off the path. Where am I going? Okay, I'm I'm lost. Go go back. Go this is good. Oh, a sign. Notice, welcome to Milltown, home of Dew Cave. Okay. This is our first town. We've left home and we've discovered a new place for the first time. So Oh, what's down here? Who dis? Yo, yo, yo. Oh, hey there, young boy. At times over the past 20 years, I would take a moment to look out to sea. I could always see them watching. Those monsters just beyond the shore. Do you feel? Okay, that sounds kind of... Oh, God. <laughs> some demon shit. No hope lies beyond the shore. That's what everyone says. It's only now, at the end of my life, that I ask myself, is it really a feel that are watching? What are those things? That's kind of spooky. Oh, what a selfish man I must be to have spent my life carefree and now burden you with troubling questions like these when you're so young. Enjoy your life, boy. It goes by so much quicker than you can even imagine. Okay, thanks for the, the heart to heart. So, I do believe that this game is intentionally trying to be a little bit darker than your average Pokemon type of game. Oh, who are these? New monsters. What have we got? Enemy Nautilus. Okay. Uh, hang on. I need to look at my type. So, what type is that? get my phone out again let's have another look that is I need to learn this is that an unstable type and they're weak against this guy so if I hit he'd probably die in one hit maybe big hit 
That's cool. Type advantage boost. And he hits me with a slime slap. Okay, that's fine. So from this, let's invite. Do you want to join up? Or, he scoffed at the pact. Okay, maybe you'd rather die. <laughs> so, you sure you don't want to join? Otherwise, I'm going to knock you out. I'm going to knock you out. Sorry. I tried to be friendly. I tried to be nice. But I guess not. I guess he didn't want to be friends. So yeah, that old man, he kind of had some spooky stuff he wanted to talk about. But we don't really know what that means. So I guess maybe at some point we'll be able to explore that. But these things are attacking us. We can fight these things off, I hope. I, I didn't even use an attack that time. My mistake. Alright, so... But he is weak against me, so that's good. So let's just swipe. Oh no, that is going to take forever. You see how little health that took off. Okay, we need to switch. Switch out, switch out, quick. Okay, Hooklaw, you're up. I think I need to get some kind of health. Health items or something like this. I can't keep running home every time. I'll take damage. Okay, good. So do I want to go down here? Not really. I want to go to the village, don't I? Aren't I supposed to deliver like a letter? What are these things? What is this? This is a belit. A little devil. <laughs> I wonder if I can recruit one. Let's try. Oh, it's level 8. It's, it's really quite strong. Hmm. Oh god, that's not good at all. Sorry, Rodesk, you're being sacrificed. <laughs> sacrificed to the devil. Okay, who should we go with? I don't even know what this thing is. I still don't know what it is. Uh, yeah, we'll use you, whatever you are. I need to figure that guy out. I really don't know what he is. Uh, yeah, that's a good hit. Good hit. Oh, God. Uh, should we risk it? Let's offer a pact. Otherwise, he's just going to knock us out scoffed at the pet. No good. And I think, yeah, you got just wiped out as well. This is not working out very well at all. No one wants to be friends. Yeah, still think about it. Still, still doesn't want to get involved. Okay, I guess we're going to have to fight to the death. Okay. Let's go with this. I think when there's that fire thing burning up like that, it disappears here. So this must be when it's strong against it. So that should be a good hit, right? Good hit! Okay. But we are actually suffering a little bit. Is there anything this way? Where? Where's the town? Where's the village? Mill town. Yeah, this is the place. How do I get down there? How do I get down there? Oh, this way. This will do. There we go. Hello. Oh, hi there. Any advice for a guy hopelessly in love? Okay, no. What's inside? Hello. Oh, what an exciting time. Kid, this will put Windy Province on the map. Well, bigger on the map at least. Okay. Will it? <laughs> Let's go outside. Is this a phone? Oh, we can phone home. Hey kiddo, is that you? You made it there without much trouble. What? Gangsters? They swam across the river? Well, I guess as long as you didn't have to deal with them, right? Well, Thanks for checking in. I'll let you go for now, but call me every once in a while, okay? Good luck. Okay. Oh, better remember Dad's request. Head into the shop and give him a call. I mean, we did just phone him, but we are inside. And we'll probably give him another phone call. Oh, welcome to the barge. Proud to serve the needs of common folk and tamer alike, continent-wide. Wait, you don't even have a pack? Well, of course every tamer needs one. You know, I've never met a tamer so young before. We'll make you a deal. You make the barge your number one stop for packs, and I'll hook you up with a fine Galutovi leather pack. Free of charge, okay. Now keep in mind it's a rough world out there. You'll lose everything in your pack if you get taken out by a monster, so be sure to store any valuables in the mini bank on your left. Oh, the phone? There's one just outside to the right of the doorway. So does that mean I can shop here? What can we buy? A normal pack is $10. Oh god, I didn't know. 
Oh, I just did a key stutter and I bought one by mistake. Okay, what else have you got? Hello, Leaf. And that is it. Okay, I don't, I don't want to... Oh, can I sell something? I have got nothing to sell. That's all I needed to know. Okay, let's go back outside. We have phoned Dad, so hopefully we're good now, right? We'll phone again anyway. Yeah, so that's the deal with the gangsters. Don't know what they want or what they're about, but sure. Who are you? Hey, can't wait to get to work. Those mines are going to make me some real cash, and I'll finally make a name for myself. I'm sure you will. Hello. What is this, a, a library or something? Oh boy, I'm making all the food the town sells to those passing through. To go to Isaac's farm is a lot of hard work. We can't afford the best of equipment here, but we always make do. Or, oh, we usually do. It seems everyone is buzzing around now that the prospectors are in town. Even the mayor has been acting strange. Prospectors, okay. The new kings, take some getting used to. They'll regularly stop by. Speak with the leaders, speak with the people, give advice, and generally seem to want everyone to be happy and have their needs met. Although, maybe that's just our king. King Dania to the east seems a little colder, and Mal to the west seems to have a lot of health issues and keeps to himself a bit more. Okay, so we're learning a little bit about this world. What is this thing? It's a huge furnace, it's blazing hot, turning the pool into steam. It seems to be modelled after some monster. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I'd want to jump in that. Okay, so let's, let's go around town. Who else can we talk to? Another house here. I mean, hello? Are you one of those prospectors? No, you're too young. This town is in the middle of starting up a mining operation. It's pretty exciting. Okay, so a mining town. Oh, Tamer, young Tamer. Come over here. Okay, who? Who, who wants to chat? This person, hello. I'm the town's healer. You look like a tamer, but you've never heard of us. No worries though. This here's my Kiri. It's a special type of monster with some pretty amazing magical powers. The kings employ us to offer a healing service and give each of us the Kiri to form private breeder. While they're unsuited for combat, they can unleash a wave of powerful healing over your monsters. Unfortunately, um, it leaves her out cold for quite a while. I'd be happy to heal your monsters, as with my comrades, but to ensure only tamers that truly need to take advantage of Kiri's abilities use them, there is a cost. If that's okay with you, just give me the word and I'll get your team healed up straight away. It's a Kiri. It seems like they're pretty fragile. So, how much? Fifteen dollars? No. I don't think so. Who are you? Cindy. Do you recognise me? You probably don't. Your mum and I went to school together as kids. Okay, so it's our mother's childhood friend. Okay, let's go down here. Who is this? Jasper. Everyone's so excited. I'm not sure why. The only one that should be excited here is me. They think the prospectors just came around out of nowhere. I'm going to own this town. Okay, he's got ambitions. What is this? Welcome to Milltown, home of Dew Cave. We, we know where we are. Hello? My daughter spends too much time with her boyfriend and starting to think that they're codependent. Okay. Hello. I just wish Mum would understand. What difference does it make who his father is? I know he's good inside. Okay, there's some kind of like family issue going on here and I don't want anything to do with it, so I'm leaving now. Who are you? While we all pay taxes to the kingdoms and the kings regularly visit to offer advice, Towns are generally pretty self-run, without much interference. With a great mayor, it's wonderful, but with one that can't stand up for himself, well, okay. Hmm, oh, we can go under the bridge. Cool. So, we're kind of learning how the local governments work. It's not quite what I was expecting. Hello. I don't really trust that guy, Jasper. He's got a silver tongue and seems to get a thrill from taking advantage of others. Okay, we're not going to trust that guy. Who's in here? Oh, this is the guy we met on the pier. It's the mayor. Sorry, I'm not much in the mood for talking today, but um, please enjoy our local wares and um, fabulous restaurants. Okay, fine. Weren't we supposed to deliver a letter or something? But I thought, wasn't that who we were supposed to talk to? Let's check our notebook. Deliver a gift to the humanism kingdom. Okay, this we're just passing through. This is not 
Uh, final destination. We need to get to the kingdom. This is just a town on our way. So, okay. I guess we'll just keep moving. Top speed. No, not this way. This way? I don't know what way. We're going to go this way. Yeah, this this seems good. Oh, who's this? It's a prospector. Whoa there, boy. We're doing some pretty sensitive work here. This equipment's fragile. Stay back in town now. I can't afford to lose time dealing with nosy folks like you. Oh, okay. It's an apprentice. Hey, boss. This place is absolutely loaded. We've got at least 20 grand today. Worth of mineral zephyr on the surface alone. Then you'll keep it down. We're trying to get a good deal on this contract. Don't go shouting something like that. Oh, sorry, boss. Listen, kid, can you keep your mouth shut? Last thing we need is for Jasper to know about this. Everyone's out for themselves in this business. We'll be working for less than minimum wage if Jasper finds out how valuable this place really is. Here, take a hundred and you can grab whatever's loose on the cave floor. Just stay quiet and get back to town until we're done. Oh, okay. So we've been bribed. And I can't go in, no? Okay. Some monsters plain outrank others with inherent power. You'd think general power level would be a good indication of a monster's power, but a powerful monster at level 10 will still be a level 10 Rodask easily. Okay, that's about the different kinds of types. I really need to learn the types, but at the minute, I really can't do it. Okay, so we have accepted a bribe? Because we think Jasper's suspicious anyway. Oh, we just got attacked. These guys did not warn us. Okay, it's a salty spout, was it called? Okay, just, just hit this thing. Is this thing, do you think it wants to join? I did accidentally buy a, a contract earlier, so maybe I can use it now. A PAX, yeah, I bought it by mistake, so let's see if it pays off. Yeah, cool. We got ourselves a new friend. That's it. Now let's get back to town. I just realised how damaged our team is. It is night time now as well. So we need to be here. And maybe we can get healed up through here. You. Yeah, please fix us up. $15. Yes, please. Kind of a spooky looking power. But no, we're back at top strength. So, what do I want to do? What is next? We got sent back to town, so what is next? So this is our mum's friend. So, we could talk to Jasper and really mess things up. Maybe we should talk to the mayor, unless he's still not wanting to talk. No, he's still not in the mood. Maybe we should phone our dad and ask for consultation, because I don't want to help Jasper. I don't like that guy I've decided. Oh, who's this? A roughneck. The prospectors are nearly done? Good news. Oh, Jasper, what do you mean? Why would they be dealing with... Oh, crap. Can you come with me a sec? Okay. But listen, it's all legal. It's in black and white. You can't argue with the paperwork. You own the only store in town. You nickel and dime us and charge us ridiculous amounts of money. We can barely afford food for our kids. You want to own the mine too? What? Jasper is going to own the mine? Of course I'm going to own the mine. You goddamn peasants! <laughs> what, you're all angry because you didn't think of it first? Because you lost a good deal when I was the one fast and smart enough to get in on it before you? That's just the law of nature, you cowards. Forward thinkers, entrepreneurs, go-getters. It's people like me who reap the rewards. Wow, the mayor was going to sign it. The deed was supposed to be ours. The king himself agreed. We should all own it. We should all reap the rewards of our work. We'd finally be on the map. We'd all be wealthy. Yeah, it's too bad. You were all too weak to reach out and take it. It's mine now. Don't you worry. I'll be sure to pay you at least a little something to work for me. You will afford to feed your children. That's what you want, right? Wow. You, annoying, noisy child. You think having a monster makes you untouchable? Yeah, I'm a forward thinker. Do you really think a man like me wouldn't be prepared for trouble like you? Okay, we're being challenged. It's a... Uh... Okay, he attacks in a rage. This guy is upset. So, what is that? What? I don't even know what that thing is. Okay, let's look at our types again. That is a... A relentless type? And I think they are weak against unstable types, which is... This one? Maybe? Uh, let's try it. What? 
He switched out? Coward. So, what did he switch it to? What is that thing? A Krista? So, two can play that game. I can switch as well. Let's go with a Harvest Skin. Switch. Oh, he's doing this kind of stuff. Okay. Oh, he's hurt with the infection. It worked. When we used the Laz, it totally left a mark. So, that is good. That is good. What else have you got? Let's keep fighting like this. I think so. Doesn't seem to be that strong. I can take my time. Nice work. Oh, we are suffering slightly. Maybe I should switch again. Because it was the last before, wasn't it? This as a zombie thing. Uh oh. That was bad. That was bad. Uh oh. Dead. Poor. Poor choices. Uh. Okay, Hooklaw, finish up, please. Let's see how we do. That's it. Side slice. One hit kill. Five experience points. Very nice. Damn you, punk. Damn all of you. You're all beneath me. Just bottom feeders, grasping for pennies. You'll never make it without me. Yeah, you better run, Jasper. Get out. You better pray I don't catch you. You think you can own us? You think you can starve our kids? Dave was right about you. What that kid did to your monsters, I'm going to do to you. Okay, he been run out of town. <laughs> That's it. Send him. Send him. That's it. He's going to escape on the boat. Oh, Dad, wait. Who's this? Abandoned his own kids. <laughs> wait, didn't we get a warning that it's bad to leave the shoreline? Oh, no. Did he get killed? Oh god, blood! <laughs> uh, Jasper got killed in his escape. Now I feel bad. Um, it's nothing to do with me. Absolutely nothing to do with me. So, um, I don't really trust that guy Jasper. I mean, I think he's dead now, so I shouldn't worry too much about it. We need to talk to the mayor. Can you tell us? Jasper, you know... He pressured me into signing over the deed to the mine. I should have been stronger for my people. They deserve a strong leader. I just hope we can move on from here and build a brighter future. I mean, Jasper got absolutely killed just now. <laughs> so that that was a bit um that was a bit unfortunate. So I guess that will probably do for this video. We killed a guy. <laughs> I'm not sure. So our party has expanded. We have now got I think eight monsters. And I think if I continue to play this, we're going to go into the mines. But yeah, let me know what you think about this gameplay. It's going to be long. If I keep playing it, it's going to be a very long gameplay. So yeah, I don't want to take up the channel with too much of just one game. But yeah, as ever, let me know. And if I'm having fun, I will keep playing it. And if you're enjoying it, I'll definitely want to keep playing it. But for now, this is Ushio signing off. And hopefully I'll see you next time.